Welcome to SCS Interiors video featuring how to remove your seat back foam kit for your Cirrus aircraft. There are eight videos in all specific to the removal and reinstallation of seat cover and seat foam products for your Cirrus aircraft. Please note this is only a general overview, but the basic principles can be applied to both passenger and crew seats across all generations of seat models. View the entire film before making any effort to remove or install any element. Please review points 1 through 5 below. Most importantly, if you have any questions, please call us at area code 218-728-1614. Helpful suggestions. Before removing the foam kit, take note of its overall construction. Taking pictures will serve as a useful reference when reassembly takes place. Note that the foam kit is made up of several pieces that are glued to one another and to a seconite shell that covers the metal seat frame. Once you have documented how the foam kit is assembled onto your existing seat, you may begin removing the foam kit. Begin by separating the foam from the seconite liner. Gently work from the outer perimeter to the middle. Try to prevent any foam from tearing away and remaining on the seconite liner. Small remnants of foam remaining on the liner are purely cosmetic. Larger remnants should be peeled away to ensure proper installation of the new foam kit. Once the main body of the seat back is free of foam, proceed with removing the foam from the headrest. The headrest consists of a base with one or more laminated layers of foam that need to be pulled apart. 